guys, it's me, Sharon, and welcome back. If you're new to my channel, hello and welcome. And if you're returning, thank you and welcome back. I'm so glad you stopped by and decided to share a little of your time with me. Here on Creative Glam, I love to share videos on how I DIY beautiful and functional decor in and around my home while on a budget, as well as the creation of greeting cards and travel and meal prep too. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit it twice so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. I upload new videos every week, so make sure you come back and tune in. Today on Creative Glam, I'm participating in a challenge, and this challenge is called the 2020 DIY and Decor Challenge. And this challenge is being hosted by Christina of the DIY Mommy. I will leave a link to Christina's channel down below in the description box. Make sure you stop by and check her out and tell her Sharon from Creative Glam sent you. This is a series of annual challenges hosted by Christina. This first edition is organization. So today I'm going to share with you how I organize my under the sink cabinet in the bathroom. As embarrassing as it is, I'm going to share with you how I can purge the majority of these things and just put back what we need. I went to Target and picked up some storage containers and I think that's going to help me to get a little control over this mess I have down here.
Ooh, I like the way that turned out. It looks so clean and it's so fresh. It was definitely needed. As you saw, all that junk. It's amazing how much junk can accumulate up under a sink. It's like a catch-all. It's, it's like a drawer in the kitchen. You tend to throw things in there that don't necessarily belong there. As I said earlier, I picked these storage containers up from Target. I was really looking for gray and I couldn't find them, so I went with the white. And I just think it gives such a clean and fresh look under there. I will eventually get to the container store and get the stackable containers that have pull out drawers. Uh, but until now, uh, well, until then, this will do. I love the way it looks. What do you think? If you enjoyed it too, let me know. Leave me a comment below. I appreciate you being here and I would love it if you gave me a thumbs up. I want to thank Christina of the DIY Mommy for inviting me to participate in this challenge. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit it twice so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. I upload new videos every week. Now that you've made it to this point in my video, click one of the video links at the end of this video to see more home decor by Creative Glam. And also click the playlist down in the description box to see the playlist of all the other participants in this collaboration. And with that being said, have a blessed day. And I'll see you right back here next time on Creative Glam. Bye!